All right, guys, we are heading out to a little pond today. I fished there a couple times before. Uh, I know there are some pretty nice bass in this body water. I got my kayak, my buddy Jesse, he's coming out with his kayak. He's got a, it's a 12 foot Cuda. I think that's what it is. Very nice looking. Um, I, don't know if, I don't think he's caught a fish in it yet, but maybe today is gonna be the day. It is absolutely beautiful out. Very nice weather, sun's shining. Uh, we are gonna get out there in a little bit and hopefully can latch on to some nice bass. Um, they gotta sign up. We might be S O L. I don't know what them, them signs are new. They got them pink signs. I'll have to see what that says. That's a good question. I don't know, I'll talk to them and see if, see if they know anything. You know when this fishing, fishing derby is? Oh, it's already, it was yesterday? Oh, okay. Awesome. I guess we're good then. All right. We didn't get much of that. You guys didn't get to see any of that on video, but uh, just had one on. And uh, oh, holy sh might be the same one. Feisty. Let's see if I can get up here. You guys hear my drag going? That's real good. It's like. I don't know if this is the same one I had on that spit the same thing. He was jumping and spit it. I cannot believe if this is the same one that he came back. He is, he is staying down. I cannot believe the fight. In this thing, he does not. He does not want to come up. There we go. Got him. <laughs> yeah, baby. Look at that thing. Gorgeous. Hell yeah! Look at that thing. That thing is pretty nice. Very, very nice quality bass here. But if that is the same bass, that thing is super feisty. Cause I had him on. He jumped. He came, he came off, and then literally next next cast, I get this thing. So he was, he was def definitely uh, ready to chomp down on a spinner. So, all right, we'll get him back, get him back in here. It's not bad. We, I've been out here for probably o over an hour now, and this is the first sign that there's even fish in here. But uh, definitely worth it. Um. I was throwing the lipless crankbait for a while and uh, with no luck and uh, switched over to the spinner and uh, probably been casting for maybe 10-15 minutes and I, uh, I got one on so hopefully hopefully we dialed them in here and uh, we can get a few more. Well, my buddy get one? I think Jesse might have I got a bass over there. He's going to pull something out of the water. Looks like he's looking at it right now. Got another one, guys. This thing is, they are feisty in here. Oh my goodness. Nice largey. Very nice largey. Oh yeah. Come here, buddy. Got him. Woo! Another one. Not too shabby. There we go. Looks like he might be fanning the bed there. He's got a 
got the old red red fins. They won't keep them out too long here. Right at the side of the lip there. Pretty good, pretty good hook set. All right, it's got it's got a bit of a gut on them. There you go, buddy. Okay. Oh my God, I just lost them. That thing was freaking. That thing was solid, right in the shallows. Possibly a snag, but I don't think so. Like it was there, he hit it, and then he just freaking, he like took off on it. Damn, he almost, he like, kind of bent that one out. I think he bent that one out a little bit. That was nuts, that was nuts. My legs are gonna be totally screwed tomorrow. They are so red. Not good. Not good at all. Oh yeah, nice. It's a pike? That's pretty nice. He's still on? Yeah. Oh, you still got him, okay. Yeah, and I don't want to scare him either if I get too close, I don't. Damn, yeah, that is freaking nice. Wow. I'm sure he's pretty tuckered out now, but. So now I'm grabbing the weird. You gotta turn. Go up from the belly. Yep. Come on, come on, come on, come on. There it is. Whew! Not much. Not much. All right, I got about 50 of them. There you go. <laughs> Not good. <laughs> oh, Not good. Mine are even red and I had screen on. Ugh. Oh my God. Yeah. Ah, uh, that feels a little better on my sunburn. Oh, them all been complaining. <laughs> Time to change their design. Heading back home, uh, we did all right. Uh, we caught, I caught two bass, which were decent. Uh, Jesse, he got a very nice 29, 29, 29 and a half inch pike. Very beautiful fish. Uh, he got, he got a, he got another fish, but uh, didn't end up getting that. Uh, I was wondering what that vibration was. Uh, it's a strap, of course. Um, he got a bass, but didn't get it on video. He was he was off in like some cove area, but the the fish were definitely some quality stuff. Burnt the crap out of my legs, the top of my legs. Didn't even think about that. You're sitting in the kayak, just you know something I didn't think about. I uh, I got my face with some sunscreen, but that was before I got out, and I didn't bring it with. So uh, yeah, I kind of screwed up on that. I'm definitely gonna be feeling that tomorrow because they are super, super red and they're already hurting. <laughs> and uh, yeah, usually it like takes a day until it starts to hurt, it's already hurting. So, you know, they are freaking baked and my pasty legs don't get much very, don't get much sun, so it's not gonna be good. But uh, overall, good day. Uh, I did, I started out with the lipless crankbait. Uh, just no luck on that. Uh, I think Jesse, he was throwing a crawfish, or a craw, like a plastic crawfish jig type of thing. Uh, he said he got a few nibbles on that. Uh, decided 
decided to switch over, switch over to the Big Normus. You guys can hear me over this, this vibration of the strap here. Switched over to the Big Normus. Uh, not too long after that, I got into that first bass, really nice. Uh, that's the one I first missed. I missed it, it fell off, and then it came back and I got it again. I'm assuming it's the same fish. Um, and that was that was very nice fish, just decent. That thing fought really good. Um, and then and then uh, just kind of roaming around the lake, and uh, ended up getting another one on a little a little bit smaller, but not not too bad, not too bad. Um, I'm looking at my rear view, and I don't know where. Where Jesse went. Hopefully, his kayak did not fall off. But I'm not not seeing him. He was he was behind me. That's the you know that just that wouldn't be good. Wouldn't be very good. Uh, but uh, I have to check my phone here. Uh, but yeah, I got that one bass, and then I I missed I missed one for sure. I seen it hit, but I couldn't get it on. And then I had another one right by shore that shwacked it shwacked it really really hard right by shore then he took off i don't know possibly could i have stayed the carp i'm not sure but that thing had some power behind it and um i ended up coming up with a hook uh, a bent treble hook so not quite sure if that's if that's the fish that did it because that would have been quite quite impressive but uh yeah overall pretty good day burnt the crap out of my legs got a couple couple nice fish not a ton you know we were out there for probably a good four and a half hours um you know didn't catch a ton but the fish we did catch were quality